person and hate the person, fight off the person who try to murder them. You still in that trouble. You still are going to get in that trouble. The person who get murdered, for them liar, the defense of them liar, I go mount, I say you assault the person. No, you know why you end up assault the person, even though them never did for them, or even though them they commit a murder? Because the means to how you get to stop the murder was that you broke into the house, you came into the house forcibly, un unannounced and uninvited. So you already broke the trash all of the people them house, you broke the law, you come there, if you come do whatever, even though you come there, come stop them from murder some, somebody. For them defense, I go use the fact for say, you broke the law, if you come, if you come stop them from breaking the law. So you are the one. When they say that how the defense are going to come and so. So the prosecution cannot use you as evidence to say the person was committing a murder unless the prosecution prosecute you too and convict you of the breaking and entering where you do. See that? What may I show you? So breaking the law is not justification for, for stop somebody from breaking the law. So the law the people them broke and down there within fifth and, and they in within fifteen feet of the police when the police sets and take the pepper spray and pepper spray them without caution in them is also breaking the law. So the two law them broke, so the two of them wrong. So the police them not right for that what them do. You understand? Somebody said, bro, people need to respect the police. Yes, to respect the police. But respect is given as respect is, is gotten. No say go. Police, they can't get in trouble. To purpose. Of course, them can't get in trouble for purpose spread the woman. Because they never cash on the woman. And that plain... And this is the problem we're doing, you know. Una as Jamaican and walk up and down every day. And watch everything on social media. And I don't know the rights. I don't know the rights. When you don't know the rights, and because you don't know your rights, you don't allow people to abuse on the rights them each and every single day. See the person that said he should have warned her and then spray. And I just and I just say, I am going to spray and spray. And I saw you have to caution the person and give the person a chance to accept the caution and then when you say the person, nah, adhere to the caution, then I will not use the force. How we do? Papa, give me five more minutes here. Daddy, give me how much candy? Yeah, give me one candy. Give me one more, just one little one. Alright? Zin? Zin, I see that somebody say, I, I think nobody thinks it's a big deal until it happens to them. That's the thing now. You know. That's the thing now. Everybody always say, she should have done this, and she should have did do that, and she should have never read it. But everybody have, for them own personal animals, you never know what you are going to do until you reach another situation there. You never know what will happen to you until you under that. Because them can't, them always say, no. You see, hindsight is twenty twenty. When you look back upon sitting and say, me should have did do, and me should have did that. When you look, start look back upon all of them something, you know, and look back upon everything where you should have walked through, everything where you should have done. It is if you say, boy, me could have do that. You should better do that because you know in the situation, no adrenaline and pump. You can't see everything from a bird's eye view and see everything. You can't see the consequences of the actions that may go on. So you can analyze and say, okay, that did happen because that happened. So you shouldn't do that. You can know everything when you're outside of the situation, but when you're in the heat of the matter and things are going, you don't know what I'm. This is why them children police in them situation, yeah. Them train police to them. So you actually go in to live the situation so you know what got um, when it comes. Say that it not take you as surprised as you as a you as a as a civilian, you don't know this a situation because you've never been in it before. So your your whatever you do is going to be a hundred percent reactionary. While while whatever the police is supposed to be doing is supposed to be preconceived because they already know the situation that they are going to be and they're already exposed to this. They're, this is their training. The lady wasn't that close for him to feel threatened. And, 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 and he, he was not threatened. But his defense is going to be that he was threatened. Which he doesn't have a, he doesn't have a, a, a pill to piss in. Because that defense is thrown out of the system. Because it is obvious that no one was there threatening him. No profanities were heard, hurled. No verbal abuse was hurled. No verbal threats or anything like that was hurled at him. No physical threats were hurled at him any at all. 
But because him a bull buck and dopey camcara and a lot of these people who wear the uniform of the government feel like they are omnipotent and omnipresent and they are above and beyond reproach and they should not be spoken to by anybody and any form of disdain or distaste for what it is that they do, they take it as the biggest insult or the biggest, biggest bruise to their ego. They feel like they have to lash out and put you back in the place as the, as the cockroaches that they look at us as. Zin, it never worked it from the police perspective, I swear. I almost got pepper sprayed. So trying to reach them. Just want to act. If I true, most of them police are going at them are judge, jury, and executioner. Them forget to them get them, them, them they are the arm of the law. They are the ex they, they are the execution arm of the law. They are not the judge, they are not the jury, and they are not the executioner. You understand? What they are there to do is to serve and to protect and to uphold and instill the laws of the land. Not for them to pass judgment. You understand? When I was at political meeting and the crowd was... You know, eh, because she was recording. Uh, that, that are the only reason prayer because she recorded him badge. And him just want to just run away. And he just want to get rid of her. You understand? No, the past prayer was need for her. Yeah. When when these go up, when these go up at the embassy, no one don't have to tell them the right thing. They know and do the right thing. If that was his mother and Sakuraka doing that, oh, at that me I try to show you, at that me I try to show you. Somebody says, so talk to me, Triple. Oh, I'm sure I'm angry. I talk that already. If I just come in, I can talk it again too. The first thing what I'm sure I do, whatever incident that me, it shouldn't reach the point where I ring out the button. First of all, why I have the button in all time and for that woman? And she was unarmed. Why I have the, the metal button extended? Because the, the button, it, it, it retract. It's a retractable button. And you have to flush it out to extend it for use it. Well, them call it a well, billy club, it name. Billy club, it name. And you use that for lick people, for broke them bone and them something. You understand me, I say? Him should have never have that in him and none at all for dealing with that woman there. If the woman had resist arrest, the only thing him did need it was him hand them. Him never need a gun, no nah, nothing. Him and him and, and him cork at them could have hold the woman and restrain her. Put her down on the ground, put her hand them behind her, put her down face down upon the ground, put her hand them behind her back, and cuff her, hold her down until she sets and stop flaring her flare, uh, flailing. And then we said, um, what next week person bring the vehicle come and then take her and put her upon the belly. If, if she still resists at that point, then put her face down in the Jeep, pan her belly, pan the back seat. You understand? Zin, put her face down, pan her back, pan the belly. And what, then put her down, pan the back, and then put her, push her, put her face down with her and then be on her back. Hold her two ankles them together and push it down over her and then pan the back. And she can't move this up. So. Restraint. Them learn that. Let me learn that. Go Google it if you think I lie me. I tell you that exactly how that same situation they're dealing. And all of them police that were graduated from training school learn them type of restraint. Learn how to subdue a disorderly perpetrator. Them learn how to do it. People, or people say she's a woman. You will not don't see the police catch a girl that do shoot at them in Mobile since week. Fine. That I want, that I want woman in Mobile where shoot after them. So, I can't ask you a question. That woman in the market where I sell her goods, where you gun there? Where the gun there? Where the woman have the gun? In her, in her change purse? That's why they need for you, you have to understand, you know. You have different levels. You have different levels of force. You have something named soft power. Soft power and you have force. Soft power is the ability to get people to do something without you having to force them to do something. That is what the that is what the army, the J Jamaica Defense Force, used to have in a Jamaica. And I say it, used to have in Jamaica. The Jamaica Defense Force used to have soft power. We are just the presence of the Jamaica Defense Force would cause criminals to not want to engage in criminal endeavors. Just the presence of them in the community. No, because of what Andrew Owens has done and his ministers of security has done and put in this zozo these special zones of operations them them something them do 
he has taken away all of the soft power from the Jamaica Defense Force. You understand? Because the police, the soldiers are on the road every single day, sit down and asleep with them gun put on, and they, he has taken away the hyper fantasization of the Jamaica Defense Force by the criminals or by the everyday Jamaican. Once upon a time, when bad man see soldier, them run up and down and go and let them eat at them, afraid of them. Even if you're not a bad man, even if you're just in our community and you're going with yourself, once you see a soldier come, you used to run up and down and hide and lock down because you don't want a soldier see a road. Zin, I saw the thing used to go. That is how the thing used to go. No. Because them come and out the soldier, them make the soldier them come like boy boy and era boy. They make the soldier them sit down at daytime, sleep with the rifle, lie down pan gun, walk up and down. Soldier look girl all day. If you go shop, go, go food shop, go turn up, go buy, go buy hundred dollar food, eight dollar and them sitting there with the same people them. The people them just look pan, look pan the soldier them same like how them look pan the gunman in their community. Or oh, does Jim Brown that to do and gun? That's it. Them not look pan the person as 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 oh a soldier anymore just die out there with the gun a uh, marky they put everybody know every soldier name now so the fanfare we used to come with soldiering done done and i know jamaican unruly jamaican been unruly if, if no jamaican unruly when you forget about the gas riot them, when Jamaica burn up, when, when, when them burn up, how much, how much trailer, gas trailer, gas station get burn up, how much road get blocked, them invade politician house and all them something there. In the 90s, when you forget about them time, look how much right now, that, that way them did raise gas to $20. Gas at $200 now. $200 a liter now. And nobody now riot. Chicken brother, chicken back at two hundred dollar pound. Turkey neck at two hundred dollar pound. Brother five hundred dollar bread. Rice a hundred and twenty dollar pound. You understand? And nobody na riot. I ya said Jamaica too unruly. What that mean right now? Jamaica too ruly. Jamaicans are we too ruly. So don't tell me that Jamaicans too unruly. No, no, Jamaican are the most manageable people. No. The only thing right now is just that it. We have more access to information. So every little ear act, everybody see it and everybody hear about it. So it's amplified. So it seems like it is more than what it really is. Back in the days, Jamaica not take chat. Jamaica not take chat. Certain things politicians could have never get away, could never get away with. If Andrew Owens did a come on TV, come say them things, we made us say in a 1993, Jamaica would be on fire right now. If Andrew Owens did have said the things that we must say on TV, no. When him every week when him come out for him press conference, Jamaica would have burned down flat ground if him did do this in a 1993. And this a fox, me I tell you. Fox, fox, fox. So when we talk about say Jamaica can too unruly, and that is bullshit on attack. Jamaica are no longer a rebellious set of people. Jamaicans are confirmative. And because you know why Jamaica so confirmative? Because a lot of you people, as Jamaicans, when a mind is so enslaved, all of us, mad, mad, we are saying, okay, them in a uniform, so anything where them say right, we not in a uniform, anything where we do wrong. Once them say we do it, we're supposed to do it. We're supposed to just comply. Anything where them tell us to do, just do what them say for do no man, and for a peaceful life. Everything is for a peaceful life. For a peaceful life. For a peaceful life. <laughs> So we believe say whoever in authority know exactly what is best for us more than even we. We believe say the prime minister of this country know exactly what, what we're supposed to take out our fridge for towel for cook. And they say thing there. And if we keep on giving the governance of this country this type of power and giving up all of our autonomy, what is going to happen to us? 20 years down the line is when the government goes to state and say Jamaicans should cook chicken back on Tuesday. And guess what happened? 
everybody i go cook chicken back pan tuesday listen now me don't want a problem you know me don't want a problem you know listen take off your pork off your fire do listen to me oh you so rebellious little girl nobody cook no pork the government i go smell the pork and come lock you up why you do this listen a chicken back them so we cook so we have to cook chicken back when people video pan say listen anjo we outside or anjo a pork we a cook police come kick off your door bumba oh, yeah. oh, yeah. But if you have a chew, a chew that fam to them because all them daffy do just cook like a chicken back. Why them have to cook pork? A dot go up. I don't understand this. I don't do not understand this. If you do not alter it, let me tell you something. Let me tell you this. There is a reason. There is a reason why there is a reason why in the legal system you have a defense and you have a prosecution. Because there has to be a balance. When somebody state the law, you have to sit and look on the law. You have to reason the law, whether what is right from what is wrong. You have to sit and argue the law. The same law will prosecute you, and the same law will, will free you and emancipate you. It is all a matter of perspective. You understand me, I say? It is all a matter of perspective. If you want to sit down and allow people to come tell you, say, this is what you're supposed to do, and you don't look on it and ask why you have to question. You have to question. That's why, when, when me have a son, my son of five years old. See me again. Daddy, mm -hmm. want to say, I don't have no candy. No candy? Mm -mm. Alright, you want a ring, Pop? Yeah. You want a ring pop? Mm -hmm. Alright, I have a ring pop at the house. So when you go back to the house, I give you a ring pop, okay? No, no, no ring pop. I oh, want candy. Can you ring pop no candy? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I want candy and the house. Alright, I soon come, alright? I come talk to Auntie Fee, alright? Give me a kiss. Tell, tell Black Stars I soon come. Alright? Zen, say my son there, if I tell my son, say yo, Papa, we are up on the road. My son, him love, him love wear hoodie them, pull over, and him love wear jacket and them thing. And them something him love wear. If I look at him and say, Papa, you can't wear, if, 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 if I say, right, boom, I take out clothes, him wear, him say, so I run going in the closet, and I'm going to take out one jacket, put on. I look at him and say, Papa, you can't wear a jacket, no, you don't wear a jacket, wear that t-shirt, I'm going to say, why? He's going to ask me, why he can't get a jacket? I'm going to say, it's too hot for your jacket. Him say, it's hot now, but when we go in the car, the AC is going to be on and it's going to be cold. I'm going to say, yeah, but it's too hot to wear a jacket outside. Him say, all right, I'll wear the jacket in the car and come out. The rational way, man. Way, man, make, it makes sense. It makes sense. So I can't look at him and say, yo, I say enough for your jacket, so you're not wearing a jacket. Because I have to allow my child autonomy. I have to allow my child... Zin, I have to allow my child a chance to develop him own a sense of self him african deduce right or render right from wrong him after deduce reasons for doing things and one of the biggest problems of this country is that we don't we don't business about the reason why people tell us to do things we just do it because people say it's supposed to be done so we just follow whatever it is that is said to be done we don't look on things and say okay what is the rationale behind us doing that you have to, have to, you have to rationalize what it is that you do and the best way to get somebody to do something what you want them to do? I fi tell, fi get them for rationalize and for know why they might do this and what the benefit of them doing this is for. That's why me not believe say people are supposed to have them pity and tell them say yo me say for that and it done this so anything me say go and I say go. Someone I say oh when you grow up in so it poil but it better you grow up in with autonomy than you grow up in for be a follower because when you grow up in for be a follower I guess so when you pick in rich teenagers and I run anything with people tell them just run back at them and get themselves in that trouble I you see when I go after reap the reap the fruits of the labor where you did plant you turn your picnic in a bombard sheep you are the one to turn your picnic in a sheep you understand me and say and subdue your picnic autonomous nature Zin and a data I'm to in another society right now we are so subdued our autonomy is 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 rooted out 
We don't question what when we see things we just say, okay, that person in a when we look on the video with the woman a, a, a fight the police them, we just say that person in a power, she a, a, a the civilian, she wrong. Anything with them do to her, she deserve it because she are the one we are fight back. So anything with them do, all if them they take the button and sell up her in her head and she dead, I fear fault because she shouldn't a fight back the police them. We don't look for excessive beauty force and the same people them. The same people them we are cause and say the police them wicked and one by are the same set of people them. Where did I put up the Black Lives Matter sitting when the police them kneel long pan judge fly neck? Remember, say judge fly that resist arrest, you know. Remember him, you know? He was resisting arrest. Remember, say I resist him, I resist arrest, and he never want to get arrested. Remember, say it's a psychotic episode. The man did have to when them sets and see it. Remember, them say it's a drug induced two times. Did inna so all of them something the man did that wrong. But yet still, all of us were jumping up and saying Black Lives Matter because the police did something wrong. He abused his authority and he kneel long in the man neck for much too much minutes and strive for the man and kill the man. And everybody came up in a, in a, and say, "Oh, Black Lives Matter!" Cause him should have never did do that to the woman. Same thing with right now. The woman are resist arrest. And black lives do matter, and Jamaican's lives do matter because the police should not have reacted with such force towards the woman or towards any Jamaican whatsoever. That is an excessive abuse of force, irrespective of the fact that the person was 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 being malicious and the person was not adhering to the to the order set by the police. The force that was was used is unjustified. So if one want to sit down here, so and all of them little sitting here, one say, okay, them done they do that. One need to understand, say, una desensitize on yourself. Una desensitize on yourself from right, from wrong. You ever hear them say, you give them an inch, and them take a mile. If you don't stand up for what is right, and if you don't call out people for the wrong, them what them do when them do the little, 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 little things them. Them all have a sitting and say, liberty come through carelessness. Them all have a thing and say, if you don't lie down with dog, you won't catch free. If you don't put yourself in a situation where you allow the police them to get away, or you allow the authority to push the envelope every minute and get away with everything with them do, you will never ever be right. You will never ever be right. All when you're right, you're going to you go wrong. All in time in the right, you are going to get around because you gave away the right, your rights when you allow the police them to mistreat and abuse other persons. So when it is you, you in a your situation where you are get abused, you cannot say anything. Because the chickens have just come home to roost. All of the seed them where you plant them are bare fruit right now. So you better grab them and suck the sour bile from them and ingest it and belch and glad because you are the one who, who gave them the authority and gave them the right to abuse the powers that was allocated to them. Remember these people. You see, all of them zone of special operation where we are allowed the government to set some put every single way. When I bear no fruit. All of them something where we sit so and the a checkpoint them all over Jamaica where they, they we, we got our bed last night and wake up this morning to be a checkpoint to see you can't go nowhere. All of them something here where we say we put on and we allow them to do. Remember say 20 years from now. When you have to go up, ask the government which Type of meat for cook on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Uno can member say Uno did give them the power. Yeah. People, I want to thank Uno very much for sitting down and listening to me. You understand? I hope that Uno did actually get a chance to learn something. I hope that the persons in the comment section who started off disagreeing with me, I hope you see my rational. I honestly didn't see much of the negative comments, but if they are there, I pray for Uno. All of Uno. You understand? I pray for every single one of Uno as Jamaican with there so. I watch this. You understand? I pray for every single one of Uno. For Uno and the, the, the next thing we talk about Uno always I say, when you go foreign, you have to live by foreign rule and foreign law. So why you not want to live by law, Jamaica? Yes, the law is there. The law is there. But you have to remember, say, every law did have to start out as legislation before it comes to in a law. And if we allow this legis legislation them are put together to turn into law, we cannot, we can't do nothing about them again after them to line you know? When they're in the legislative stage right now, when they're right, they will say, Yo, eh, 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 eh. this no makes sense, you know. Change that. When no, when we can't say change it, I know if we say change it. You understand? People, big up on yourself, yeah. Thank you very much for tuning in. Daddy.
I thank you, yes, Papa. Hold on, hold on, hold on.